How to select a research topic. Beginner's guide to conduct research. Table of contents. Introduction Make sure your topic meets the assignment requirements. Ask your professor for feedback if you are unsure. Choose a topic that is interesting to you. It may seem obvious, but this will make the research process more fun and engaging for you. Consider the scope of your topic. If your topic is too broad it may be hard to find information that is focused and relevant. If your topic is too narrow it may be hard to find any information at all. Here the first example is food safety which is too broad. But on the other hand, the research topic will be better by focusing on impact of government regulations in the United States on food safety. Second example is too narrow which is history of organic labeling of halal products in the city of Portland, QR. But on the other hand the research topic will be better by focusing on labeling of organic food in the United States. Strategy for developing a research topic Background research will help you develop your topic and hone or change it in more appropriate ways. Knowing more about your topic's background can only help you develop a more effective topic, and therefore, research paper. Brainstorm concepts. Once you think of a broad topic that interests you, try to brainstorm all of the words or concepts you can that might be related to that topic, and write them down. For example, if your topic is, polar bears, you might think of the following words and topics in association, ice, cubs, pollution, hunting, diet, climate change, and environmental icon. Develop a research question once you have come up with a broad topic and done some background research, you may want to develop a research question, or a question you're going to answer in your paper by doing more, in-depth research. What's your general approach to the topic? Think about some general approaches that may help you further develop your topic. Use a historical angle by focusing on a particular time period, a geographical angle, focusing on a particular part of the world, or a sociological angle, focusing on a particular group of people. Start doing some exploratory, in-depth research. As you do more in-depth research, like looking for scholarly articles, books, and other sources to include in your paper, you can and probably will modify or refine your topic based on what you find. Research is a dynamic process. Don't be afraid to discover new things and modify or refine your topic. The topic development process will help you to develop your thesis, which is essentially your proposed answer to your research question. You will then be ready to use the sources you've found, and find more sources in order to support that thesis, or to answer your research question. Here's an example of how the topic development process above can lead you to a thesis. In Figure 1, topic ideas such as organic food, labeling and food safety will lead to write background research easily. The background research leads to write the research topic question. After in-depth research leads to write the thesis. The figure 2 is about the process of selecting a research topic. It will focus on requirements of assignment, ideas for potential topic. The upper side of figure 2 is based on the requirement of assignment will leads to three things in which you are passionate about and mainly your interest that is assignment parameters. After that you will easily write tentative topic. The lower side of figure 2 is based on the requirement of assignment will leads to potential topic and your topic interests. After that you will easily write tentative topic. Figure 3 is based on searching background information which is to identify, clarify and extract research topic from research area. Tips in selecting research topic. In your major subjects in BS, MS, PhD, focus on your favorite subject or that subject in which you got high grads. High grads subject will lead to understand difficult terms in advance. Select supervisor which has an expertise in your favorite subject and area in which you want to conduct research. Some universities assign you a supervisor based on their own criteria, so in this case, you will not worry about it. In your favorite subject select area i.e. major field is finance. Major subject is managerial finance. Research area is financial ratios. Read literature clarify variables for example, the impact of financial ratios on stock returns, evidence from banking sector of USA, or the impact of liquidity on financial performance. Evidence from banking sector of USA, if literature and data available then continue otherwise change the topic. Share research topic with supervisor based on his, her specialty. If he, she is interested to work with you then continue to write proposal. Some supervisor assign you his, her own topic for research by saving your time. After proposal approval, start working on thesis. Don't waste time and must focus on data collection as well after proposal approval. 
Convert a broad topic to a narrow topic by restricting certain parameters here a for example which is from broad to a narrow topic. Unemployment problem in Pakistan Unemployment problem in the mining sector of Pakistan Unemployment problem in the iron ore mining sector in Pakistan Unemployment problem for mining graduates in the iron ore mining sector in Pakistan. Friends framework for selecting research topic. 5W and 1H for selecting a research topic. Please subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper thanks for watching.